Alright, uh, please keep the love going and the enthusiasm really going for our youngest ever performer. Please welcome to the mic, Progati. So this is one of my poems and it's called I Sang. By the way, my name is Pravati and I've never been too good, good with intro, so I'm just going to get on with the poem. I Sang. Let go, said my heart, for the feelings are all long gone. Let go, said my mind, for so much more is to come. Let go, said my bones, for the pain is too much to hold. Let go, said my skin. For the moments are just too cold. And even though each part of my body cried, even though I felt all the pain, I felt all the agony and anger, and so many emotions swell up at once, from my hair to my toes, from my heart to my mind, each cell was begging me to let it go, to forget it, to remove it, to erase it, but I didn't. No matter how much they screamed, no matter how much they cried, no matter how many times I almost gave up on me, I just couldn't seem to give up. I just couldn't gather enough courage to let go of all the things that made me feel so alive. They said it would kill me, and it did. They said the pain would be unbearable, and it was. The pain of thinking about letting go was unbearable, and even though I knew my pain, even though I knew it would hush the cries, even though I knew it could maybe somehow give me peace, I couldn't. Because all those feelings, all those memories, all that everything I felt was way too precious to let go of. How could I kill the one thing that made me feel alive? How could I let go of the one thing that hold on to me when I felt like leaving? How could I betray all the feelings that helped me feel so much more? I am not asking for it to come back. No, I don't want it to come back. No, I would never ask for it to come back. But I would never forget it. I could never forget it. I could never forget how magical each moment felt. I could never forget how amazing each second was. So now, when I don't know what to do, I sing to myself. I sing, I've been thinking too much. I've been thinking too much, help me, I sing, little do you know how I'm breaking, I sing, baby I came on too strong, I sing, hush little baby don't you cry, everything's gonna be alright, and when I finish singing, I read, no not books, quotes, I read so many quotes from so many pages because they somehow express it better, and I cried, no, not my body, not my bones, not myself. I cried. I cried because I had been cruel. I had been cruel to myself. I had been so cruel to myself that I almost lost myself. I almost pushed myself so far to the edge that with a few more steps I had fallen. And I don't know if I would be able to pick myself up. I cried because I knew I would never be that cruel to anyone if it weren't me. And then something happened. My heart beat slowed, as if to say it was ready to live again. My mind stopped swirling, as if to say things were clear again. My bones no longer cried, my skin no longer screamed. I realized I needed it all. I needed all the memories, I needed all the pain, I needed all the cries. And maybe, maybe I needed the push, because from that edge I was standing on, I saw things. I saw things so much better, I saw things so much prettier. That day, I'd given myself the most rare and beautiful gift I could. The gift was me. Brothers and sisters, welcome to Pranati.